every girl I know all the time is two things. Freezing. <laughs> starving. Oh my God, I'm so cold. Is anybody else freezing and starving? No, it's 78 degrees in there and there's fucking food everywhere. <laughs> You're rude. You're a rude person. They all say the same thing too. I haven't had anything to eat all day. <laughs> you haven't had anything to eat all day. I had lunch. <laughs> but like you don't have lunch? I don't know what the fuck women are eating at lunch. You eat the most obscure shit in the world at lunch. You'd be like, all I had for lunch today was like a little bit of coconut water and a handful of hummus. <laughs> Were you captured by Al Qaeda at lunch? <laughs> you know when you're freezing all the time, you don't dress for like there's weather. <laughs> women dress for the first 30 seconds of wherever they're going. They dress for like the big entrance to the party, like yeah! ah! And then you spend the rest of the party like, nah, I'm freezing and starving and my feet are and we have to go home. <laughs> but I'll bring girls out. Girls don't get it. I'll bring a girl out. Other girls try to be hateful. Come up and be like, you can do so much better than her. And it's like, oh, I know, but I can't take that chance. And then guys will be hateful in a different way. They'll be like, dude, you know that girl's only with you because of your career, right? And I'll be like, yeah, of course I know that. Why do you think I have a career? <laughs> what do you think I rely on my body to get women? No, my 18th birthday, I stood naked in the mirror and I was like, you better write some jokes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> These are those jokes. Girls, you don't know. You don't know how good you have. Yeah. You want to keep a guy? Here's what you do. Be cool. Have a lot of sex with them. That's all you got to do. Throw your razors away. <laughs> Never shower again. One outfit from here to eternity. <laughs> Be cool. Have a lot of sex with them. I could be at a party. My buddy Mike could walk in with a girl, greasy, matted hair, wearing newspapers and rags, and be like, who's that homeless-looking chick with Mike? And be like, oh, that's his new girlfriend. All they do is have sex and watch Breaking Bad. I'd be like, my God, she's beautiful. <laughs> Wonder if she has a sister as gross as she is. <laughs> but I know why you want to dress. You want to frame your bodies a certain way. Bodies are fantastic, women's bodies, fantastic. But let's be honest, they make no sense from a design point of view. Big boobs, then tiny little waist, then big hips and big butts, and then stubby little legs and small little feet. Like, if you told an architect to build a woman, he'd be like, it's not safe. I can build it, but a building that shape is never going to be able to heat itself. It's going to be freezing and starving her entire life. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Bye.